I don't get it. You've always hated Aaron. Yeah? So? I admit it. I've never been his number one fan. But he doesn't deserve to go down for this. We won't get the money back, you know, after the trial, no matter what the outcome. I know that. You can call it a loan if you want, but we can sort all that out later. <sighs> I know it seems mad. And of course I'm not just doing it for him. You know how much I still care about you, Chaz. You know I can't accept it. So why offer? I mean, why are you putting me through this? Because I can't sit back and watch you lose your son. Not when I can try and stop that happening. <sighs> this isn't about me and you. That's exactly what this is about. I want to help you. Why can't you see that? It doesn't matter what you feel about me or what's gone on between us. Right, so we're ignoring the fact that I jilted you and fleeced you, are we? You won't be able to forgive yourself if it went the wrong way for him. Not when you could have done something about it. I wouldn't worry about it. Chaz is in a right state at the moment. She's shooting from the hip, that's all. She's right. It was Jackson facing prison. You, you can have the fanciest lawyer on the planet. There's still no guarantees. Yeah, but at least I'd know that I tried. Yeah, I'll do that for you. No charge. Oh. Mm. Uh, made those drinks last. Yeah, well, we broke till payday. You want to worry when you're broke on payday, love. Hey, there's more to life than working, money. Uh, is that why you wanted to get back with me? Yeah, I just know you can't live without this. See ya. Bye. I wish that I could help you. Just that I'd be lucky to get a small increase on my overdraft these days. You're a lovely man. I don't need to get into debt. I'll tell you what, I'll, uh, I'll get Brenda round to babysit. Yeah, I'll grab a bottle of vino, come round yours later. Uh, no, Tar Bob. There's things I need to do. See ya. Ta -ra. So it'll be transferred immediately then? That's great. Um, no, that's it for now. Thanks. Bye. You sure about this? Carl's gonna get all the glory for bankrolling Aaron's defence, but it's your cash. And before that, it was Dad's cash. If it wasn't for me, he'd find the money somewhere else. You don't think it's a good idea, either. He's being genuine. I know that much. And Chas isn't dim. Hopefully, she'll take the money and keep her distance. How did it go? Yeah, good. I've left her to think about it. Sounds like trouble to me. I want to help. I hope she sees it for what it is. Not just hoping that Chaz will get back with you, then. I'd give her the cash either way. <laughs> yeah, OK, so I still care about her. I hate seeing her strung out like that. I don't think I could stomach seeing you and Chaz go through all that again. You've not exactly got a great track record. Oh, give us some credit. We're grown-ups. She'll see sense over the money. Right, come on, spill the problem, not the wine. <sighs> problem shared is a pain in the butt. Honestly, you don't want to know. Yes, I do. Carl's offered to pay for a barrister. A good one. He's what? Oh, I wonder why. I didn't exactly snatch his arm off. Trouble is, the brief that Aaron's got defending him is a dead loss, and he doesn't even realise it. <sighs> Carl's off his head. Not seriously considering it, are you? Of course not. It's a big old gift horse to look in the gob, though, isn't it? Especially when the rest of your son's life depends on it. Right, well, what about Kane? Can he help? Oh, yeah, and have the plod sniffing around, wondering where he's got his hands on that kind of cash. No. <sighs> Besides, I know how to handle Carl. If you say so. Jenny, what if he goes down for this? How would I feel then? Well, how do you feel about Carl? <sighs> Same way I do about them gorgeous red shoes in my wardrobe. The ones with the paws? Mm-hmm. They cost me way too much, and I know if I put them back on again, they'd hurt like hell. Why should he pay them, really, shouldn't I? <sighs> Jerry's gonna be in that witness box lying for all he's worth, and he's not gonna stop until Aaron's banged up. Chaz Carl is trying to get to you. He's winding you up. Don't fall for it. You're right. 
Not trust you got on this one, OK? Stay away from him. Oh, I am. There's no way I'm going to let him screw me over again in a hurry. Fresh air and a good walk. Not all it's cracked up to be, is it? Been bothering call centres. For all the good it's done me. I'm trying to get a couple of grand off a loan company. That's not going to pay Aaron's legal bills now, is it? So you think it's a good idea, then? I'd try anything to help him. But I'm potless. And not very credit-worthy, apparently. I can't even afford to pay the rest of Jackson's headstone. Jenny reckons I'd be mad to even think about getting myself in that kind of debt. No guarantees, eh? That's what Bob said. You've every right to feel the way you do, Chaz. I got him into this. I'd do anything to make it right. Well, more right than it is now. I want to get him out of this as much as you do. I can get out of the money. Don't even worry yourself about it. Um, and don't ask. Is Aaron going to be up for it? I mean, you know how stubborn he is. I am about to find out now. Do you want me to talk to him? You know what? You look like you do with going home and getting your head down. I've done enough damage, eh? I'll take care of it. Do you want a beer? I'm having one. You said it was urgent, so what's up? Are you sure your barrister's up to scratch? Well, he's gonna have to be, innit? We don't have to use him. He's sound. Stop worrying. What if we had a choice, hmm? What if I had the money to get a top-notch brief? You must be mad because you're as broke as I am. I'm getting a loan. Don't worry, it's fine, I can manage. It's one of them long-term ones. Aaron Love, you saw how Jerry was. I mean, his lies could sink you. <sighs> He's just not thinking straight. Exactly. He could do you some real damage with that jury. I just don't want him taking it out on Hazel. She can't handle it. Aaron, please! You are going to have to start putting yourself first. I'm not going to lose you, so please just let me help. Just think that we can get someone who's done cases like this before. So, who's lending us the money then? Paddy? Kane? Carl, but before you start right, I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, no wonder he wanted to fight my corner. No, Carl understands why he did it, but he knows that a jury might not. I told you, my brief's on it. Yeah, but is he the best we can get? So did you ask for the money or did Carl offer it? Does it matter? The one phone call, one phone call, that's all it would take and we could be in chambers tomorrow sorting everything out. Carl offered, OK, but what difference does that make? Aaron, just think about it. <sighs> he was facing what you are once. It could have all been very different for him. Carl just wants what we want, which is the best outcome. Don't worry, I'm having a hold over you. He won't have. I am never going back there again, trust me. I know what you like. What he's like. Can you not just get your head around the fact that people care about you? Carl has a lot of sympathy for what you did for Jackson. No, he must have it bad. Well, that's just tough then, isn't it? Because you are the most important person in my life and I will do anything to protect you. Yeah, and that's what I'm worried about. If there was any other way... Well, there is. 
I've got a legal team. I don't need Carl flashing his cash around to get some posh boy barrister in. No, Aaron, please. I'm begging you. You need to do this. Please, just, just do it for me. I can't. I can't. I can't take that kind of money, especially not from him. Yes, you can. Beggars can't be choosers. Well, yeah, but they don't have to prostitute themselves, which is exactly what you're doing. You want me to just stand around and watch it all? I can be a pimp or something. It'll only end up hurting you again. Listen, you're my mum and I'm not letting you do it. All right, so tell Carl. Thanks, but we don't need his cash. <laughs>